All right, let me show you where I'm at. Uh, this is my ground up build. Pretty bad shape. T-top, that's where I'm going. That's where I'm going with it. This is a bad, bad shape. But, I think I'm going to turn it out. It's been sitting for a while. I bought it for a project. I never really got to it. I was investing in my Impala. So, bing. I bought that Yukon for the motor out of it. I pulled the motor out. I sat it on in here just to see, first of all, to get it out the weather. But just to see fitting wise. I'm thinking I got to change these motor mounts because this was a V6 car. Um... I know with this motor, I'm going to have to change that intake, put a car up on it. And, um, so I'm going to have to pull it back out, probably pressure wash it, clean it on up. And I want to paint the inside of the fender wells up under here and stuff, clean all that junk out. So I got a project, man. Press the front clip off of it. So I'm going to order one of them SS front clips, but man... Y'all pray for me. This look like it's going to be a long trip. I'm pretty sure. Um, I'll get it running in a couple weeks or so. Get this transmission bolted up. What what happened was I took a, uh, I had a 350 motor and a 350 transmission in here. And I had it running and everything. I never even took it around the block. And then I took it apart. Which is, I hate myself for that. So, uh, missed that Vortec going in here. Out my donor truck. No. Uh, any ideas or anything, man? Best routes to go. Always up for advice because I don't know everything. This country boy, I like to do it myself.